Another day, another story. Comets have been in the spotlight this year, but only some attention has been positive. Numerous headlines have emerged about a devil comet heading towards Earth. What's the real story behind this celestial visitor? Let's look at this devil and determine if there's any cause for concern. Spoiler alert, there's no need to worry. The so-called devil comet is called Comet 12P Pons Brooks. This comet follows a short period of orbit, circling the sun every 71.2 years, much like Halley's Comet. Fun fact, comets with periods less than 200 years are considered short period comets. Comet Pons Brooks has been part of the solar system's history since 1812, when Jean-Louis Pons first spotted it. However, precise observations weren't available back then, making it challenging to predict its return. William Brooks rediscovered the comet in 1883. Some astronomers suspect it might have been recorded during previous passes as far back as 1385. Estimating the comet's size is difficult without direct observations from spacecraft or radar. A 2020 study suggested its nucleus might be around 10.5 miles, 17 kilometers wide. That's larger than Mount Everest, although it's likely overestimated due to measurement challenges. Despite the potential overestimate, Comet Pons Brooks remains a sizable celestial object. Halley's Comet, for comparison, has a similar size of about 9.3 miles or 15 kilometers, confirmed through spacecraft visits. Comet Pons Brooks has a highly inclined orbit, bringing it from above the plane of the planets. It will pass through the inner solar system, between the orbits of Earth and Venus. Importantly, it won't cross Earth's orbit. The comet's nickname, Devil Comet, stemmed from an outburst in late July. During this outburst, it brightened by about 100 times, earning its dramatic moniker. Such outbursts are unpredictable and rare, but Ponce Brooks has displayed this behavior multiple times per orbit. The outburst transformed the comet's coma into a distinctive horseshoe or horned shape. The media embraced the name Devil Comet due to this intriguing appearance. Astronomers are still unraveling the mystery behind the comet's horns. They suspect the uneven release of gas and dust might be causing this unique shape. Another possibility is a shadow effect, where certain areas block the bright material behind them. Despite the mystique of the horns, there's nothing evil about this celestial phenomenon. Sensationalized headlines can mislead readers into thinking Pons Brooks poses a threat to Earth. While it is heading in our direction, it's not a cause for concern. At perihelion, the closest point to the sun, the comet will be at a distance of 0.8 astronomical units. This is equivalent to 74.4 million miles or 119.7 million kilometers. It's closer to the sun than Earth but is farther away than Venus. Pons Brooks doesn't cross Earth's orbit as it passes through the inner solar system. The comet's highly inclined orbit allows it to pass between Earth's and Venus's orbits. It will never intersect with Earth's orbit, so there's no impact danger. The closest approach to our planet on this orbit will be about 1.5 astronomical units in June 2024. That's one and a half times the distance from Earth to the Sun. When Comet Pons Brooks last reached perihelion in 1954, it provided a memorable celestial event. The following perihelion passage is expected on April 21, 2024. This date is just two weeks after a total solar eclipse on April 8, 2024, which will cross North America. Comet Pons Brooks will be visible near the Sun during the eclipse. It might even be bright enough to see with binoculars, and an outburst could make it visible to the naked eye during the eclipse. Comets, in addition to their beauty, offer a chance to study our solar system's building blocks. They provide insights into the interaction between the Sun and its orbiting objects. So, the next time you hear about the Devil Comet, remember it's not malevolent. It's an exciting and benign visitor, enhancing the experience of a rare eclipse. An unforgettable astronomical spectacle awaits. Thanks for watching.